the Revere parent is accusing a fire captain of racism after he got into a fight with young trick or treaters on Halloween. News Center 5's Liam Martin tells us the captain appeared in court today saying he was defending his family. The defense then struck the 14 year old in the back of the head. With club. Captain Carl Holmberg facing four felony counts, accused of beating three juveniles with a golf club Halloween night. You know that. Tell the truth. The father of two of those kids shouting at Captain Holmberg as he left court Monday. Jameson Gim, that's a picture of Robert Bland, the 11 year old and the 14 year old. They're good kids, they play football, they don't start no trouble. He's been helping people for 13 years. The incident began 7 30 Friday night near Vane Street when a group of kids, 10 to 14 years old, cut through private property. When Holmberg confronted them, he says they began harassing his six year old son and his wife, and then eventually came after him. Mr. Holmberg. In the 11 year old down to the ground, there was a golf club in Mr. Holmberg's hand. Police say they had to pull Holmberg off the boy and that he had struck three of them with that club. He shouldn't even be on the force. This man says his 11 and 14 year olds have welts on them. He claims Holmberg instigated the altercation and then chased the boys down. And during our interview with Holmberg's defense attorney, that father charging that race played a factor. It was hunted down like little in the street. Okay, well, Plain and simple. the world according to Garp. It's not According racial. To a father. It's, it's not racial. Is there anything that Carl wants to say? Captain Holmberg would not talk with us directly Monday, but his attorney says he did what any parent would do. He's with his own six year old, he's with his wife, and this will get sorted out. Now, Holmberg claims he did not actively strike the kids with that club, just fended them off. He's on paid administrative leave from the fire department and is due back in court November 20th. I'm Lee Martin, WCVB News Center 5.